Miss Lost Fitness. Today is leg day. We got my boy Bradley here. He doesn't really want to be here right now. He just wants to sleep. But we're here anyways. Gonna get it done um, early in the morning. Um, today is actually leg day part two or phase two, whatever you want to call it. And we are starting with deadlifts. But first, before we go to the deadlifts, I'm gonna do a little skipping, a little bit of stretching, you know, because it's leg day, you gotta come correct. Can't be coming from the cold, which it is outside, into the and just to go, you're gonna injure yourself. So I'm gonna skip for like three, four minutes, stretch out the joints, you know, do the hip flexors and whatnot, and then we're gonna get into the actual workout. Ready? No response, that means no. Let's go do this. So welcome back to another commentary now to start off with this workout we did skipping around two three minutes of skipping simply just to loosen up my joints and get my body warm again it's early in the morning my body technically speaking is still sleeping so i need to wake it up you know wake up the machine and for me skipping is the best exercise to do um as a cardio you can use a treadmill and all that stuff bike but i prefer skipping simply because it also builds muscle I love skipping. It works your shoulders, your wrists, your calves, your everything. It's just good stuff. Your abs, solid, solid exercise, and one of my favorites to do. Um, I I don't know what I'm doing. Am I trying to do the split? So, uh, <laughs> but yeah, honestly, I'm just trying to loosen up my hips because I got pretty tight hips and leg day. Leg day is no joke. You know, I'm I'm one of them ones when I do leg day, I go all in. Actually, every every exercise, every session I do, I go all in. But leg day, I literally try to push myself because I really do want to develop my legs even more. I feel like my legs are probably the slowest to like grow and see definition. I feel like I hold most of my body fat in my legs and my lower, like my ab section, lower lower abs. Um, so I feel like those are the my upper body gets lean pretty fast. So yeah, I really do want to develop my legs um, and just get them juicy so stretched i rotated like two three times did this over and over again and then we went in and started off the workout so first exercise we're doing is deadlifts now i have two leg days a week so this is leg day two start with deadlifts leg day one i do squats as my first exercise so i rotate i change it up so deadlifts as you can see i am using the bar um again i advise people always start off with the exercise as a warm-up so use the bar or do it without the bar um here i'm just focusing on my whole form really trying to contract you know what i mean like stretch out the hamstrings as well you know keep my back neutral position and now we're getting into the actual stuff again work up i don't go straight into like 180 kg no that's not smart you want to work it up and you know do a couple reps here and there you know you still want to get some sort of volume within your workout but again these are all warm-up sets i'm not counting these uh, this is not part of my program i haven't counted this in my program i only count my working sets so if i do like six warm-up sets it don't matter i'm still not gonna count it this as well I'm not counting in my program got what 140 on the bar and i'm not using the belt again the reason why i'm holding the bar like this is because i also want to work on my grip strength now my grip strength is something that you know i just want just want to make it better i want to be able to pull 180 or 200 kg off the floor like with this grip um i do notice though my workouts like when i do deadlifts if i have chalk it's way better now we're working as you can see i've got a belt on 180 and i've done here what two reps with the standard grip um it's difficult i'm not gonna lie i could feel it slipping like here look boom slipped i only got two reps with this so i was like to badly now nah, keep recording i'm gonna change up my grip and yeah it made a humongous difference like i don't think you guys understand the difference it makes that was rough having deadlifted in like six months <sighs> or maybe i've done it like once or twice in between that six seven months period but i haven't like consistently deadlifted in a very long time that felt heavy 180 felt rough um and see as soon as i changed my grip i got another so it's a neutral grip i'm trying to obviously increase my grip strength so i tried it as much as i could and i only got two and then i changed to the, like a lock grip and 
did another two reps. So for that like 180, I'm gonna do, try and do it one more time for four reps and then move on to the next exercise. Oh, I hate leg day. I hate it. So like you said, like I said there, I said I'm gonna try and do 180 for four reps. Let's see what happens, ladies and gentlemen. What does he do? Does he do four reps or does he make it, well, I don't know, three, two reps? Let's see where he gets. So I changed the grip, as you can see. This is the good one grip. I got one there. Ooh, that's a nice one. That was clean. Hey, that looks too light. What's going on here? Ooh, three, okay. Wait a minute, that's a four. Oh, he's, he's still going. Five, you're lying. Six, you're lying. Seven, oh my, okay. So my man got seven reps, yeah? All right, all right, all right. I'm joking. <laughs> I already knew I watched this before. So here, I was supposed to do hip thrusts, but we don't have a hip thrust machine and I could not be bothered to make it happen, like make up a hip thrust machine type of situation. So we ended up doing goblet squats. And let me just say, these goblet squats were no joke. This was actually my first time ever performing this exercise. And yeah, it, I, I was hurt. I was struggling struggling is a madness <laughs> but really good exercise if you haven't tried it definitely give it a go um yeah it really really works your hamstrings and your quads it's just a great exercise here i was like i got stuck <laughs> but yeah loved it um again sweating buckets because that's what i do on leg day i just sweat like a madman uh leg day hurts me man hurts me real bad so here we're doing standard standing leg curls on the leg extension machine um i really like this again we don't have a standard i think we do actually it's on the left side of me here but i don't like that machine so i prefer using the leg extension one and just here just focusing on the hamstrings you know just squeezing the hamstrings you know nothing crazy no crazy heavy weight you know what i mean where well, i can't perform the exercise right here you just really just want to focus on contracting the hamstrings you know that mind and muscle connection and great exercise i feel like everyone should be doing this exercise for hamstrings you know because i did deadlifts i didn't want to do stiff legged deadlifts as well um because that's just a lot of stress on my lower back and um, this was a super set with abductors or i don't know what hip hip doctors hip doctors this one this one ooh, 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 the inner inner ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> Yeah, this one's painful a lot of guys don't do these exercises you know the abductors and the i don't know what this one's called hip hip abduction i don't know but yeah this was a good exercise i actually have taken this one out of my program actually have i i can't even remember i think i'm still doing it I'm, I'm still doing it guys um and then we went on to the second to last exercise lunges now i love me them lunges I think lunges is pretty, probably one of the best leg exercises to do. Um, really works your, your overall leg and the glutes. And I superseded it with a kettlebar stiff leg, stiff legged deadlift um, to really exhaust my hamstrings. And it also puts a little bit of stress on my lower back, back as well. And I really want to develop my lower back. I want that Christmas tree. Uh, Bradley really dislikes me right now. He, he he's not. <laughs> <laughs> you really don't like me right now, do you? <laughs> the faster I do it, the quicker you have to do it. Just remember that. <laughs> He's walking all fucking <laughs> So we have made it back from the gym. That is the workout for today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Um, yeah, legs rough. There was a couple of exercises that I was actually supposed to do today. Uh, which was the hip thrust and hack squat. Those two machines are in the other gym across the road. Um, we didn't go there. Not across the road, but on the other side of the main road. I'm not the one across my house. So I didn't get to do those two exercises. That's, that's why we involved the goblet, goblet squat. I don't know, is it, that's its name? But the second exercise that we did, um, I added that in and did some standing leg curls as well super say with it. i kind of changed the workout a little bit not to my actual program that i have so i need to remember that for next time um that i've got a leg day um phase two so phase two is always uh, at the gym across the road um but other than that i didn't really change anything else just kept it as it is um the last two 
exercises we did as supersets, which was fun. But overall, it was a great workout. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to smash the thumbs up. Um, if there's actually any type of videos you guys would like to see me do, um, whether it's to help you or, you know, challenges and stuff like that, um, obviously mainly related to fitness, then I can do that for you. Um, but yeah, we out. Thank you for watching. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. It's your boy. Miss love. Fitness. Love life. Love life. Love life. Love.